There are several versions of the story on how the cross is found. In some, Helena has a dream telling her where the cross is buried. The Ethiopian Coptic tradition, still celebrated as Mescal, she follows smoke from a bonfire to the site. They start excavating. They uncovered three crosses. One was thought to belong to Jesus Christ, and the others belonging to the two thieves to test and see which one of these crosses truly belonged to Jesus Christ, they brought a leper. He touched the first one, and nothing happened. He touched the second one, and still nothing happened. Finally, when he touched the third and final cross, the leper was instantly healed. It was this cross that healed the leper, and for that reason, it is known as the true cross.